Hey everybody, welcome to the Gear Mind. Gear Mind. I just wanted to do a review quick before I went to bed on. I. Don't judge me. My Casio LK280. I'm gonna try to figure out how to link a video of me playing that. I got it August 4th, and by September 4th, I had memorized the song. And as of two days ago, I mastered the whole song. Well, I mean, as in I can play it from start to finish. I'm not saying I didn't mess up a part or two, but it is Moonlight Sonata by Beethoven. And it took a lot of work to memorize it, but I just wanted to show how awesome this keyboard is that you could learn how to play pretty much anything on it. And so I can't turn my camera around. Okay, so I think I'm gonna have to cut it here and then try to link these three videos later on since I figured out how to do that. So I want to turn around and see my piano. So it's going to cut and come back on just so I can do that. Okay. Okay. So this is Cicasio. The keys are really, really, really nice. And the sound, I, I don't want to play the sound on here. You'll hear it in the song. It's not going to sound as good on the on this as it does in person. In person, it really sounds a lot like a piano. Unless, if you're like super, super piano professional, whatever, well, you wouldn't want this one anyway. This one's for teaching. Well, maybe you would. Not to say that you wouldn't want this one, but you, you might have a different one. You're not, you're not getting a keyboard to learn how to play. You already know how to play and read music, which I don't. But I learned how to play with this song. So basically, I'm sure it does a whole lot more than I... I know what it does. I only know how to do what I wanted to do. And what I wanted to do was learn how to play songs. So basically, you would hit auto, and then it would turn on, and then you type a number for it'll play any of these songs. And it has 100 songs. They're not all listed right here. There's a book that has the rest of the songs, but you would type in the number, hit auto and what happens when you hit auto is it goes to listen which means listen to the song playing then it goes to watch as in like it'll light up which keys coming and tell you which finger to play and it'll wait for you to play and then remember is where it'll want you to do it without the colors so just to kind of show you how that works i'll just let it play number one which is somewhere over the rainbow and I don't know that song. So. It lists what number it is, what section it is. And then the first part is just to just listen. And it's set to only play the right hand. But we can change it to go left hand or both hands. So, this how it starts. Boy, did I pick a good one. It's not doing anything yet. Um, here it goes. No? Yes? Ah, there we go. I don't know why I had the big old intro. And as it lights up, it tells you which fingers to play. And so now it's going to wait. It's going to hold these keys down until I play them, which I can't do and play the piano. So I should have picked something easy like this and do it one-handed. Oh, it's playing left hand. I 
You know, it sounds super easy. That's why I picked it. So now on watch, it tells me. One. Play with finger one. One. Play with finger four. Play with finger four. Five. And so it'll do that. And then as you do it more and more and more, you get comfortable, you know, it's like. So yeah, the trick is to just keep playing it over and over again and use the right fingers. So you get that muscle memory and yeah. So pretty much if you ever want to learn piano, and you got at least 15 minutes a day to play this thing because that's about all the time I put in. Maybe 15, 20 minutes every day. And some days I, I played for maybe half hour, hour. But I tried to get in just like one or two rounds of the song, like five, ten minutes in the morning and like five, ten minutes um, when I got home from work or before I went to bed. So now I'm going to attach one last third part of the video where I actually play Beethoven's Moonlight Sonata. Um, there's just so much stuff on this keyboard. If you know anything about keyboards or you want to know anything about keyboards, you might know more of what this stuff is than I do. I don't care to play drums. I don't care about the tones. I don't care too much about changing any of the sounds. I just wanted a piano that could teach me a lot. That had a lot of different songs on that it could teach me. But it's a great quality product and I got it from I want to say American Music Company I'm gonna have to double check that and post it in the in the down below in there down there there somewhere down there there's a little arrow you click it open it and it's in there all right uh, this ain't the end of the video, but it should cut to my song now.
And if I did that all successfully, this is the end of the video. And if you enjoyed that review and it helped you in any way, send a thumbs up so someone else can find this video too. And thanks for tuning in to The Gear Mind. If you want to see review videos, unboxing videos, tree videos, wrap videos, or even my 30-day juice cleanse that I'm on right now, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. That is The Gear Mind! Exclamation point, baby!